Hey guys, Rubrics Cuber88 here. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys some 2x2 Ortega walkthrough solves. Okay guys, so just a quick disclaimer before we get into the video. Um, one, the cube that I am using is my main 2x2, the Mohuan Shosu Chuan 2x2. It is very, very good. I do use the Ortega method. I average around 8 seconds. So if you are trying to get like sub 10 on 2x2 with Ortega, this might be the video for you. I will try to provide you guys with the best tips and tools that I know for Ortega. So guys, all of the scrambles in this video will just be random hand scrambles. So this is just an informational video for 2x2 Ortega solvers that are trying to get sub 10 because I average around 8 seconds. So let's get into the walkthroughs. So here we go, just gonna do just a random hand scramble. Okay, so what you wanna do is a tip for your bottom face is you want to look for a face with the most colors. So in this case, I'm going to go with green and this, the side that you are solving is always gonna be on the bottom. So we just have to find the last green piece to go right here and that is back here. So to get it back here, down to here, uh, what I would do is I would turn it and then just insert it with R, U prime, bring it in the slot and R prime. And then what I would do, another helpful tip, is once you're done with your face, turn it so you have a bar facing you. Okay, so once the bar is facing you, I do I have the bar facing me, so it is easier for me to solve the last layer. So now that our face is done and our face is on the bottom, the opposite of green is blue, so this side is going to be the blue side, and this is a soon case. If you guys want to know all of the last layer cases for Ortega, I will link the I will link my video tutorial on the Ortega method in the description below. So this is a soon. So just R U R prime, U R U two R prime. And now here's where the bar comes in handy. I know because it's opposites all around that it's going to be the one bar case which have to turn it so the bar is on top and facing us and it's just the bar case r u prime r f2 r prime u r prime and that will solve the two by two okay so just on to the next hand scramble okay so in this case there are no bars or no three solved sides so in this case, I'm going to do red because there's already two here, so um, I can get this red into here by just taking it out and then reinserting it, just like that. So now we have three, and our last one is up here. To get the last piece down here, when it's on the, this top face, just move it over to the left-hand side, and then bring up to pair it over and back down, and there's your red face. And now, here's our bar on the bottom. Have it be the bar face us. The opposite of red is orange, so, and this is another soon case. And that solves the orange. And then for the last layer, we have the two bars. When I say to hold the bar in front of us, it saves us a cube rotation. So, if we were like this, we had, we had, if we were holding the cube like this, I would say, oh, we have the two bars, so I have to rotate and then do the L. But in this case, we had the bar in front of us, so all we had to do was a U prime and then the two bars case, which I have that in my tutorial video linked in the description below. On to the next solve. Okay, so in this case, I will be solving. Hmm. I'm gonna go with white, so I have the bar here. I'm going to get this piece in here first by doing U R prime. So we have our three. Do a cube rotation, and then to get this down here, I just R U R prime, and that gets the red. Our bar is already in front of us. 
and the yellow was solved. So this is a very lucky case, and so we had the two bar case again. And that was solved a two by two. Okay, we will do two more. So in this case, I'm going to go with red because it is a three move layer. So we have our two on the side here. I'm going to match up these two pieces by just doing one to match it up, two, and then three or four, whatever. And our bar here. And then the opposite of red is orange. So here is another soon. And then we have our two bars. So just do that out. And that will solve the cube. Last one. Okay, so I'm going to. Okay, so I'm going to go for orange. So to get this piece down here, just take it out. R, U to get it out of the way, and then just match these two up, bring it over, and bring it back down. And there is the orange with the bar already in front of us. And then we do a U2, and this is F, sexy move F prime for this OLL. F sexy F prime. And then our last layer would be two bars again. And that will solve the two by two. So yes guys, that is just how I solve the two by two using the Ortega method. If you guys have any questions or concerns, then please put them in the comments down below. Um, please follow my Instagram at rubikscuber88 underscore official. And that's it for me. I will see you guys in next week's video. Hope that I've taught you guys some Ortega tips. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.